What's up guys, I thought I'd make this quick video uh, to show you a feature in iOS 4.2 uh, which is the new firmware uh, for the iPhone, iPod Touch, and iPad. Uh, so maybe you're thinking, uh, what's new in iOS 4.2? Like, why should I update my iPhone uh, right now uh, and go through all the trouble of doing that? Like, what's what am I going to get out of it? Now here is a really great feature I wanted to show you uh, that I really, really liked and I've really been wanting on the iPhone uh, for a long time. Uh, and this is really great. I thought I'd just show it to you really quick because uh, you may have even updated iOS 4.2 and overlooked this. So the feature is being able to set custom tones for contacts uh, when they text you. Now this has been a feature on tons of phones for a long time. Don't know why they didn't set this up on the iPhone at first, but I wanted to show you guys this really quick because you may have overlooked it, as I said. So I'm going to go to phone. I'm going to go to Twitter. I'm going to go down. That's the uh, Twitter contact. That way I don't have to show anybody's number. And uh, there you go. You see that I have Twitter. And uh, you're just going to hit edit. And you will see uh, your ringtone or text tone. And you can customize it to every contact. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and put this one on bell. I'm going to keep it the same. Uh, you've actually got a ton of new uh, sounds too. I don't really like these for text messages. Uh, but maybe you're into this kind of thing. I don't know. Uh, they're kind of long. So yeah, I'm just going to stick with the one that I was on, uh, Bell. Pretty quick and simple. Uh, and that way you can set custom sounds uh, for certain contacts. I really like this feature because I get a lot of uh, tweets uh, that I follow uh, from like big tech blogs and stuff so I can be up to date on the news. Uh, and Twitter is sometimes annoying on my phone because I get tweets like every few minutes. That way I know it's from Twitter and I'm like, oh, okay, I don't want to check it right now. And if it's from an actual person, which it doesn't happen off, uh, very often with me, not going to lie, uh, then I can see that it's it's obviously pretty important if somebody's texting me. So there you go. Just go ahead and add that in, hit done, save, uh, whatever. And uh, that's basically it, how to add custom sounds uh, to contacts uh, for their text messages. So that's it. Thanks for watching. Sorry, this is a simple, quick little video. Just saw I'd show you guys this because I've really been waiting on this feature and I'm finally glad they added it. Make sure you hit the subscribe button up there for more tutorials like this and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.